On the 11th of May 2008, Olaf Melberg was set to face West Ham United. The Swedish international had eight years at Aston Villa. He then went off to Italy to play for AC Milan. This was supposed to be the perfect send-off for Olaf Melberg. If Aston Villa beat West Ham, they would go into the UEFA Cup. And they did just that. They got the chance to compete for the Enter Toto Cup where they eventually got Europa League football the season after. Olaf Melberg had made sure that they was Aston Villa shirts both home and away for the people who attended the West Ham game for the last game of the season. And I've managed to get both of the home and away shirts that were given to the attendees for that game. So without further ado, let's review them. Well, I don't actually know the number of long sleeved shirts to short sleeved ones uh, were given so that makes it even rarer that it's in long sleeves so there you go i was actually quite surprised when someone posted it to me and i got it with long sleeves because i do actually quite, uh, quite like long sleeve shirts there i actually had the 2008 shirt as a kid but not the rarest one you can get so it was very, very cool to get one of these because these are really, really rare to come by now. We go to medium. I'm actually in, uh, small to medium. So that was pretty, uh, pretty cool that it was in my size. Okay. So moving on. Melberg for thanks for support. And it's not actually in any, any like Premier League font or anything. It's actually... Uh, just a little bit of a print so that's what makes it very very cool so this is the short sleeve version and it's in an XL in size which it fits me okay because back then uh, they were pretty tight fitted so yeah it's perfectly fine really so there's the sleeves there oh hang on a minute let's just show you guys the sleeve details so this is the nice little ring bit that goes around it and it blends in with the uh, with the light blue lines going down here AVFC and Nike Fit both in claret which is a nice touch and there's the ice cream van how funny the ice cream van as soon as I start to record so the AVFC uh, is in, in a white would have liked it to be in light blue actually that would have been a nice touch and it says over here Aston Villa Football Club it says it both on, on both of the shirts so I might as well just show you on the one there you go, Excel, dry fit. The badge application on this is really, really nice. I like what Nike did back in the day with those ones. Very, very nice what they did to that. I like how they did the sponsor as well, 32 red and claret and claret and blue with the nice little bits there. So, there you go. That was Shirt Stories, guys. Thanks for watching. There's going to be a lot more videos like this which uh, go down... Um, the all the la 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 hopefully you guys enjoyed that video i actually had fun making that one really so uh it was fun i really enjoyed it hopefully you guys enjoyed it as well and thanks for watching and um, just before i go there was 3100 fans in attendance so that would mean there would have been 3100 or just a little bit under that so that's uh that's the news for you on that one guys 1,600 of these were ever made, half and half. So, yeah, that all adds up to, to 3,100. So half was home and half was away, which is a, a, a pretty rare shirt now. I'm, I'm uh, actually thinking of it like that, really. So considering that there's actually 42,000 uh, Villa fans there, it's pretty damn cool that I've got a shirt that, only 1,600 fans were only able to get. And as I said before, that one's long sleeve, the home one. So that's even rarer. So yeah, really, really cool. Thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully you guys liked it. Take care. Have a good day, guys.